Hi, my name's Brogan Jones and I'm Head of Bra Testing here at the University of Portsmouth. To carry out the testing, we place motion sensors on the breast and torso to measure breast movement. We do this by tracking those sensors within an electromagnetic field. And where those sensors are placed directly on the breast within the bra, we can be really confident in the breast movement that we're capturing. We measure the movement of the breast during a controlled treadmill run. So we'll track the motion of those sensors forwards and backwards, side to side and up and down. And we're then able to calculate how much breast movement is occurring overall. The participants run on the treadmill in each of the sports bras and when wearing no bra. So this no bra run acts as a baseline for us to compare all of the support that the bras provide. The power sports bra was rated as a high performer for all three directions of breast movement reduction. The participants also said that the power sports bra felt really secure and they really liked the high neckline that provided full breast coverage. Overall, breast range of motion was reduced from 9.3 centimetres down to 2.5 centimetres when wearing the sports bra. This sports bra has moulded cups which lift and separate the breasts and we found within research that this provides high support. Our recent research has found there are five key features that contribute to high breast support. So these are an adjustable underband, high neckline, moulded cups that encapsulate the breast and a high nylon content. And we were really pleased to see that the Runderwear Power Sports Bra had all five of these key features. The participants rated the Energised Sports Bra really highly for comfort and ease of putting on. The participants also commented that the Energised Sports Bra was soft, comfortable, lightweight and easy to adjust. Overall, the Runderwear Sports Bras reduced a significant amount of breast movement and the participants found the bras were really supportive during running.